What's up, YouTube? Jeff, your style OG. And on today's video, I've got a quick guide on how you can pack easily for that weekend getaway. If you're new to the channel, we release a new video every day at 4 p.m. Eastern discussing various men's lifestyle topics, such as style, grooming, and dating. I invite you to subscribe, tap that notification bell, and join us. And to my returning friends, like Curtis Miller, salute. Now you're excited. You got a weekend trip or a quick getaway plan, but you don't want to pack a bunch of bags. You want to be able to pack one bag, head out the door, and be prepared for anything that might come up during the weekend. I'm here to tell you, you've come to the right place. I've got this down to a science with a little bit of art on how to get everything in one weekend bag and be ready for that weekend. I'm talking tops, bottoms, accessories, and everything in between. So without any further delay, let's get into this quick guide on how and what to pack for that weekend trip. Now, when it comes to packing for that weekend trip, I want you to remember three key words, versatility, layering, and efficiency. That's gonna be key throughout this pack. And to make this quick and painless, I'm gonna go from bottom to top, starting with the shoes you need. Now, when it comes to the shoes, remember we're talking about versatility. You only need two pairs, a pair of all white sneakers and a pair of brown dress shoes. And I like to pack my shoes first. I don't want the possibility of any dirt on the shoes getting on my clothes. One pair I'm gonna wear, one pair I'm gonna pack in the bag. I choose to pack the white sneakers and wear these brown double monk straps. And throughout the video, you're gonna see me sprinkle in some things to do with the accessories. Now with the white sneakers, you see I snuck my brown belt and my socks into the shoes, packing the bag much more efficiently. You're gonna be wearing brown shoes, you need that brown belt. Now we're gonna work our way up to the bottoms. I suggest you take two pair of pants, one pair of shorts. One pair of pants you wear on the plane or in the drive to wherever you're going, the other pair you pack along with the shorts. The pants you need, your dark denim, once again, versatility is the key, and a nice pair of khaki chino shorts for the possibility of some warm, relaxed weather. And for my third pair, I like to bring that most versatile pair of pants, a pair of chinos. For this trip, I'll pack the denim in the shorts and wear the chinos on the plane. As you can see, we're packing the jeans and the chino shorts right on top of the shoe. This pant selection will have you ready for anything. You can dress the dark denim or the chinos up or down. Now let's keep working our way up. Let's talk about the tops you should pack. This is pretty easy as well. Pack one nice t-shirt, a polo, and an Oxford button down. The Oxford button down, super duper versatile. You can wear it tucked, wear it untucked. If it gets too warm, you roll up the sleeves. Super versatile. If you need a more casual look, a warm weather look, throw on your favorite t-shirt. Need a warm weather look, that's need a little bit step up from a t-shirt, pack that polo. Go ahead and pack the polo, t-shirt, and Oxford button down on top of what you already have bag. And you can easily layer the polo or the Oxford button down for one of the last pieces we're going to pack later in the video. Now, of course, if you're going to be packing for the weekend, you're going to need a great weekend bag for that trip. Like the one I have and I'm using throughout this video from today's video sponsor, Bespoke Post. Now, Bespoke Post is a great subscription service just for guys. They help guys mix drinks, deck out their pad, and of course, for our purposes, travel in style. And they do this with unique products and smart advice. Now, Bespoke Post offers guys boxes with superior quality, seriously unique goods that add up to way more than the $45 monthly cost. Talk about boxes that give a spark to a sharper you. Goods and guidance for the modern man, always helping you discover new things and products. So make sure you hit the link in the description, take your personalized quiz, and get started with your first unique box from Bespoke Post. And for our last clothing item, even on a weekend getaway, you might need to dress up a little bit, but it is the weekend. Keep it casual. So I suggest you pack a nice, relaxed cotton sports jacket, like this unstructured cotton one I grabbed from Peter Manning. If you're worried about that jacket being wrinkled when you get to your destination, I've got a link in the description of a video I did on how to pack a suit jacket with the least amount of wrinkles. Check that one out. Go ahead, fold that sports jacket like your OG taught you. Put that on top. Soon as you get to your destination, you want to grab that out of the bag, hang it up, maybe put it in the bathroom, turn on a shower, help get some of the wrinkles out. Now the next to last thing I like to pack are my other essentials. I'm talking about the underwear. 
Your underwear you can just squeeze in any holes that are left inside of the bag. Easy peasy. And for your other necessary accessories, I suggest your favorite pair of sunglasses and a simple brown watch that'll match with that brown belt and your brown dress shoes. I'm gonna wear the watch, probably put the sunglasses in my pocket, no need to pack them. And last but certainly not least, the last thing you wanna pack in that weekend bag is your dot kit. Your dot kit is absolutely necessary. That's where you're gonna put all of your essential toiletries you're gonna need throughout the weekend. You know, your face wash, your shaving cream, your razor, any of those things. Slide that in the dot kit, pack the dot kit in the weekend bag. Now when it's time to head out the door, throw on those chinos, grab the bag, you're ready to go. You're packed for a fun, relaxed, but stylish weekend. And you might be asking Jeff, what about if I need a jacket or coat? No need to pack that. If you need that for the weather you're in or going to, wear that on the plane. So there you have it. My quick guide on how and what to pack for that weekend getaway. As always, I hope you enjoyed the video. If so, hit that like button. It helps the channel to grow. And of course, tap the notification bell so you don't miss any of the videos we release every day at 4 p.m. Eastern. And I'll check you out tomorrow.